October is a tough month for Carshalton Athletic. Five away games, four on a Tuesday, and the first of which is against league leaders Horsham. The hosts have settled into Isthmian Premier League life rather well since being promoted last season. 23 points from their opening 10 games puts them into first place, and they beat Hornchurch 1 0 here at a top of the table clash last Saturday. Carshalton fans will note names like Robbo Tall and Charlie Harrison in the Horsham lineup tonight. Plus, keep an eye out for number nine, Chris Smith. He's already scored 10 goals this season, although he hasn't hit the back of the net since mid September. Carshalton enjoyed another victory in the FA Cup last weekend and have been rewarded with a home tie against Dagenham and Redbridge in the fourth qualifying round. But tonight is a platform to make a statement in the league. Victory taken from a first visit to Horsham's new stadium would reaffirm the Robins promotions aspirations. There are two changes from the side that won 2 1 at Lowestoft. Ola Sabamu and Omar Karoma come in as Peter Ad Adenyi and Ernold Haxiu drop to the bench. There's a slight all time will chill in the air, but we expect football to be red hot tonight. I'm James Barrett Sterling and you're watching Robins TV. We're off on underway here at the Camping Mile Community Stadium. Kamara wants someone to come short. He goes longer this time for Patterson, who's got a little bit of space here. Corbeau is coming in at the back post. First effort of the game. Beaten away by Bentley. Still live for Carl Shorten, though. Good cross by Price. Karoma coming in, headed away by Hayward. Free kick by Harris, who put it in rather flat. Bradford looks to get on the end of it, which he does. Price tries to put Christy Patterson away. He's got the pace. Can he make it? He's got him behind now. Was he taken down? Was he the last man? Harvey Sparks could be in trouble here. Patterson turned on the afterburners. The Carl Shawn players are asking the question. Referee's got some thinking to do here. Will the card match the colour of Horsham shirts or Carl Shorten's? It's a yellow. Cheadle winds up, gets it on target, has clipped the top of the bar. I think it took a flick off of Bentley on the way through. Referee's given a call up. Mighty close for Jordan Cheadle there on that free kick. Almost hoping to account for the season. <coughs> Mills looking to travel forward, does well. Smith can't. Smith does get it under control. Here's Pamant. Feeds it in through for Hayward, who's supporting the attack. Here's Mills again, he's gone. And he's gone down under the attention of Samuels. The home fans want a penalty. Referee said nothing doing. Kelly making a stride forward, here's Smith, Hammond, O'Toole gets it onto his right foot, has a bang, Bertrand who has to beat it away, hooked away by Dudley, speculative by O'Toole but why not, signal goes up, there's a big clutch of players by the penalty spot, goes up towards the edge of the six yard, headed away by Dudley, Horsham trying to keep it alive, ball's been blocked, but it's dropped for Shelley. Oh, ambitious from the big centre back. He's got two goals already this season, but that one was way off target. That's you looking towards the right wing. Big header from Bradford there, and it's uh, been hit up into the air. Karoma manages to touch it down. Can Kabora go shot off? He can! Blocked away by Bentley at his near post. Something out of nothing. And it goes to inside the six. Oh, it's there! Carl Schultz to take the lead. No, Lysman's flag's gone up. It won't count. Omar Karoma looking incredulous. It's a heavy pass and Patterson can, might get onto the end of it. He does and he's round Kelly. He's got options to his left. He picks up Bradford. Can he get a shot off? Needs a bit of support now. Merchant's done well to hold him up. He's gone down. It's a penalty kick to the Robins. It wasn't cynical, but it was a blatant trip. And now with Jerry and Moo not on the pitch, who's going to take the penalty responsibility? Looks like it's going to be Omar Karoma. It's going to be Karoma against Bentley. He's taking his time, the striker. And he puts it low to the goalkeeper's left and he opens the scoring. The Robins sting the Hornets. 
It's Karoma's fifth goal of the season. And Carl Shorten, go one goal to the goods. Hertz, are you looking for Corboa? But he's holding his ankle and Mills says thank you very much. Brings it forward. Horsham looking to get back on level terms quickly. Here's Pamant. Mills again inside the car, Shorten area, gets it onto his right foot. Price heads it away, it's come off of Pamant. And uh, whoa, Petra, you didn't seem that confident, but it hit the top of the net. Mills looking for Smith, who does well to hold the ball up and bring Pamant into play. Here's Mills again, he's seen a lot of the ball down this right hand side, but Pamant digs out a decent cross. It's been knocked down into the mixer. He's Smith. Yeah! He's got Horsham level. Clinical finish. It's his 11th goal of the season. And my word, did he take it well. That's got the home fans smiling again. And it's now Horsham 1, Carl Shorten Athletic 1. Mills again looking to get forward. He's been lively his first half. Here's Harris onto his left foot. It's opened up for him. Yeah! And he's beaten Perch to the U. All a little bit too easy. Horsham have gone from 1-0 down to 2-1 up in the space of five minutes. The danger all started with that man, Harry Mills again. The right back's been performing excellently for the home Horsham side so far. Corner kick comes in. Kamara's gone to the near post. It's deeper than that. Nodded down. Bradford tries to keep it alive. Still got Cheadle in support. First time in from the left back. Head of Goldwood straight down the throat of Bentley. Uh, the big men can come up from the back, Shelley and Merchant striding forwards. Harris wants to get on with it quicker, quickly. He's making the signal, Smith's right on the goal line. Goes in quite flat. And it's dropped for O'Toole. Good save by Perk to the U. Got down to feed it away at his near post. First real effort of the second half for the home sides. And it's brought a good save out of the car, Shorten goalie. Samuel's over halfway. Again, he's looking for options. And now he looks to spin one over the top. Patterson's coming in here. Oh, he couldn't get on the end of it. Might drop for Corboa away off target. And that'll be a first substitution of the game as well for the visitors. And it's, it's going to be Omar Karoma to make way. Maybe he's picked up a little knock. But Carl Shorten's goal scorer is going to make way. There's a double substitution for Carl Shorten in actual fact. And now here's Haxiu, who's one of the subs. He's at the edge of the area. Gets a shot off. Wow, what an instant impact he could have made. It's going to be a corner kick, but Samuels has been left in a heap. Horsham's first substitution of the game. It's going to be Haywood to make way. And he's been replaced by number 15, Jack Rivio. Brought down by Adenyi. Needs a bit of support, finds Haxiu. Strong in the challenge, past Brevio and now Samuels looking to get Patterson away but again Carl Shorten trying to be too intricate and the Horsham defence are reading those balls like an Enid Blyton novel. Patrick looking for Patterson this time, gets in front of Sparks, knocks it forward for Bradford, Haxley's making a burst, here's Corboa, lovely ball by Bradford, can tricky Ricky conjure something here. Onto his right foot, gets a shot off, not too far away. And he looks to bring the ball away again, here's Smith. Dispossessed by Dudley who picks out Corboa, he's away from his man this time. He's got Samuels in support, goes for goal. Good save by Bentley. Corboa's kept it in play. Digs out across. Here's Patterson on this near side. Tees up Price. Dinks it up towards the back post, nodded down to Samuels and he's offside. Unfortunate there for Carl Shorten, decent attack. Well, that's a bit loose there for Pertoliu, he done well to stretch in. Chris Smith's eyes lit up there. Could have been an early Halloween present for him, horror show for Carl Shorten. Goes in for this, Pertrini just did enough. Oh. 
It's going to be Chris Smith to make way. Horsham are going to make another substitution. He's going to be replaced by number 17, Zach Newton. Second. Uh, to with his left foot this time, gets it forward. Free header for Merchant. But the email acknowledges that he was a bit late there. Well, Harris scored a free kick against Carl Shorten in the FA Cup last season. It looks like he's lining up to have a strike here. The Robins have put up a wall of two. He has had a go. Way over the bar. Cheadle hasn't got anyone really making a run now that corona has gone off. Carl Shorten do look a little bit toothless up top. But here's Corboa looking to get a Sparks. Gets in a low cross. It's been dropped and bundled in by Bobby Price. Carl Shorten with star parity. It was a decent low cross by Corboa. And it's Price's first goal of the season to make it Horsham 2, Carl Shorten Athletic 2. Game on. He's gone long looking for Corboa, who's in front of Sparks, who manages to get a foot on it. Drops for a Denny. Here's Samuels. He's got Patterson making a break on the far side. Mills has gone across the cover. Patterson gets it onto his right foot. One way and then the other, but he's been forced out. He's surrounded by yellow shirts. He's done well here to get it back. And he's, oh, forced a great save out of Bentley. The away fans have got their tails up now. Carl Shorten in the, in the ascendancy. Corner kick goes in. Nodded down. Here's Samuels on the edge of the area. Taking a deflection. It's found Cheadle. He's not offside. Knocks it up towards the back post. Nodded down. Here's a Denny. Tries to tee up Samuels. Great save by Bentley again. Carl Shorten looking to keep it live. Samuels chips it up towards the back post. Headed away. Here's Cheadle. And he's given away a free kick. Kelly can't get it under control. And now Samuels has stolen in. Corbeau is looking to make a burst in. He's picked him out. Can he get a shot off? He can, but he was on the stretch. Bentley blocks it away. Corner kick. Wonderful pass by Samuels to pick out his teammate in the first place. Cheadle's gone in heavily on Newton. I think that is on the far side. Horsham looked to come forward. That's late in on Kamara. No tool becomes the third player to get a yellow card this evening. Haxu's nipping in as well, but it's been cleared by Merchant. O'Toole being there, sure, early, but that's great play by Michael Kamara. Leaves it for Bradford, he's continued his run forward, Kamara. He wants the ball played in. Cheadle chips it up, here he is the centre back. Ball it down, oh. Lionsman's flag went up anyway. Still yet to score for the Robins. And now here's O'Toole, he's got a bit of space here. Gets it onto his left foot, square for Pavlo, he's got a bit of time. Big miss. He needed to keep his head over the ball. Great opportunity at either end for each team. Keeper distributes it out quickly and it comes off the top of Danny Dudley's head, throw into the home side. This is anyone's game at the moment. It's a good strike. Great save by Padu. The ball's still alive. Pamut's kept it in, as he know. It's going to be a corner kick. Patterson's not going to get on the end of it. Cheadle now, he's bundled into the back of O'Toole. He's already been booked, Cheadle. Referee's reaching into his pocket. We've got more late drama here. It's a red card. Jordan Cheadle dismissed for coming into the back of O'Toole. Carl Shorten are going to end the game with 10 men. Horsham want to make another substitution, their last of the game. It's going to be Kieran Pamant who missed that big chance about three minutes ago. And it's going to be number 12, Steve Metcalf, to enter the fray. Mills tries to feed it forward, blocked away by Dudley, but still with the Hornets. Referee signals for the end of the game, that's full time. Carl Schultz Athletic lead the league leaders with a point. Thanks to Bobby Price's equalising goal on 76 minutes. We had literally everything in this game. Carl Schultz converted a penalty in the first half to open the score in via Omar Karoma, but Horsham turned things around before the break. Goals from Chris Smith and Charlie Harris putting them firmly in control. Game ebbed back and forth in the second half, but Carl Shorten came more into it as it wore on. Price struck from close range after goalkeeper George Bentley couldn't keep out Ricky Corboa's low cross. 
And despite the fact that the Robins had Jordan Cheadle dismissed for a second brick of offence, right on the stroke of full time, they held on to take a valuable point. Next up for the Robins is a local derby against Kingstonian at Colston Avenue. On Saturday, Robins TV will be there. But for now, I'm James Barrett-Sterling and we're going to get some post-match reaction from this one.